the fully gay. Energy. Give me some energy. Yes, yes, yes. Welcome everybody to episode 188 of the Fully Geek Pod. We have the core four, the awesome foursome. Come on. Yeah. Just Miley Mar missing today. But as we know at the moment, everybody seems to be taking weeks off whenever they want. Nah, don't be um, trying. It. It's because days keep move, moving and shifting around, brother. Don't go on like we're just taking days off because we're taking days off. You get me? <laughs> All right. Well, we knew Rich. So, 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 certain patterns are changing. We, we knew Rich weren't going to be on last week, Kel. You, you gave us no excuse. You just told us you weren't coming. I told you, yeah, but so you knew I wasn't coming. Yeah, but there was, there was no reason. Bro, you, you, think you, just, you think you just call up work and say I'm not coming to work today? Brother, <laughs> listen, because I, I remember I I knew late that. Uh, it was in my mind that the day was going to be changed to get me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, stop, stop resting into a nice hole, bro. Bro. That's <laughs> so really bad. No, no, you know, bad. I have plans. So I, I couldn't, ch- I was trying to change those plans. And I couldn't. Do you know what I mean? So I was like, yeah, I can't make it today, lads. I can't make it, man. Okay. Popcorn is nice, boy. Well, <laughs> cinema, cinema popcorn, yeah. Is it, was it sweet as salt, yeah? <laughs> Standard. <laughs> The big one, we do, we do, but yes, um, nice to see everyone. To see everyone, nice. Oh, no, it was it you that did you? You never used to like mixed, remember? You use a use a sweet, no, 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 I always like mixed. I don't know, no, no, at first, it was a straight. I'm always, I'm always a sweet person, yeah, yeah, no, I, 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 I I do mixed, I like salted ones. I can't remember who it was, I was like, nah, but it's all about the mix, like, nah, 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 it's all I can't do mix. And one time they tried it. I can't. I thought it was you, Nate. It must be someone else. Yeah, no, no, no. I don't, popcorn. I, I'm, I'm a mixed man. I, I can't do a whole sweet. I don't think. I nah, can I can't do a whole sweet. I can't do a whole salt. Yeah, so nah. I like a mix. Me too. Like Serious. Diabetes <laughs> coming. <laughs> yeah, it's too much. It's too much. For me, man. It's too much. It's too much. Man. I can't do it. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. The worst experience ever of popcorn will still to this day be New York. I have no idea what they put on the popcorn. Maybe it was butter or something. It was the worst experience of my life. And the worst thing about it was, because I'm so used to eating popcorn, all that was disgusting, we just kept on eating it. Oh, New York, in it? Yeah, yeah, it was horrible. That's like the worst popcorn ever. Bro, I don't know yeah. why it was horrible, but worst, you know, like, bro. you're in the cinema, you're like, oh, this tastes disgusting, but you're still going, and you're like, no, but this tastes disgusting. <laughs> like, what is this? this is I, think that what might, is this? I think that might be an American thing, you know, because like, every time I listen to, like, YouTube and they like, they go pop, they go to the cinema and they're like, they got to put the butter on the popcorn. And the thing is, it probably makes my mouth full. I'm not going to lie, but I'm oh, like, I can't you... imagine just putting clove all over my popcorn. It was the worst <laughs> tasting popcorn ever. Yeah, yeah. What's you watching? <laughs> Aliens in the Attic? Aliens in the Attic. That was sick, though. That was sick. That was sick. That was sick. <laughs> Bro, bro, I yeah. swear, Dad, every time I tell people I went to New York and we went to the twice to watch Aliens in the Attic and G.I. Joe, bro. We get cussed. Cussed all like, bro, the time. I, I mean, yeah, we'll, we'll get out of the hotel at like 2 p.m. Like, ooh, like, you think it's time now? Yeah, yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's hit, let's hit town. <laughs> at 2 p.m., you know? Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, we were lazy. Left, fell asleep in G.I. Joe, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because we, we, we were like in Jersey which are the borderline. So we have to get like a late, we have to get like a late bus back to the hotel. Mm. So if you miss that last bus, then it's, yeah, it's peak. Stuck. And I swear we got, we missed a stop once, didn't it? Yeah, we missed a stop. You told, it was, I... you told me it was this stop. I said, no, nah, no, it's not. <laughs> and then we ended up in some place called Hackensaw, bruv. Bro, torrential rain, remember the torrential oh, rain? Torrential rain. And I went to the petrol station, I said, can I use your no, phone, please? No, Merv, it was a horror film. You know what the horror film was when the yeah, bus yeah. stops in like mid, like the midtown? And there's yeah. not all, you, all there is a petrol station. There's no houses, no nothing. And torrential rain. I just wait for a vampire to come and eat me, bro. That, <laughs> that was I've the next thing, bro. I've already heard that place in the Superman, you know. Yeah, brother. I was knocking so on the Jersey, knocking right? on the door, you know, knocking <laughs> yeah, on the door. Yeah. I said to the man, Can we use your phone, please? Just to phone the hotel. And I was like, Nope. You know what he's thinking? What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You two black guys, this is some robbery. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like, it's is good to see you here still, where <laughs> bro, he was not. Bro, I was lying to, to him. Came. You know, like we was lying to him. Like I haven't got a phone. Bro, and I had to pull out my phone. That were international calls. What? They, what? they just keep. Come on, no what's up them days, yeah. No, bro, I had to call the air at the hotel. Nah, no, no what's up them days. Bro, like, I had to what? call the hotel. The hotel what year was this? Two thousand nine. About two thousand nine, I reckon. Yeah, around two thousand nine. Yeah. 
the hotel, they just came and collected us, no problem. Yeah. They rated us. Like, they just come and collect us. Yeah. Like, anytime. Yeah, no worries, us. man. What, what, what station you at? All right, yeah, we'll be there for sick. Yeah, we'll send a limo. They were sick, bro. They were sick. Yeah, nah. But, I'm not going to lie, the weather here is still whack, 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 well, whack, no, it was whack. nice. It was nice the other day. It was nice today-ish. Yesterday, 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 yesterday was nice Saturday. as well. Saturday, 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 Saturday was nice. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Saturday was nice. When I'm I was, here I was in out Spain, about. we're hitting forty. I hear that, but but we're not in Spain, brother. Bro, like I ain't gonna lie, I seen people rocking the shorts and t-shirts. I'm like, it's not that hot yet. No, Saturday you could have. Saturday you could you could have got away with it on Saturday. Yeah, Saturday. Yeah. Saturday. Nah, man. And anything after four p.m. is a write up because it's not getting cold and it's like spitting yeah. as well. Maybe really. that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I don't think it was a shorts thing. No, like it, it was a light jacket, maybe no sleeves, like no jumper, no sleeves. No, no, I was, I was, I was Saturday. I, was, I had a jumper, like a light jumper, and I was okay. blessed. Shorts? Was blessed. No, 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 come on, man. Rich? No, no, no not this time. <laughs> okay, cool. That's that's my that's my barometer. It's, that means it weren't hot. However, I did get excited at the prospect of it being really because it's meant to be seventeen degrees. I, I got excited to myself. Give me two days. Give me two, three days of this weather. Then I can start cutting the grass. Isn't it? <laughs> start raining. Got... Yeah, of course it started raining. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> wow. That's upset. I was varnishing my table, just finished the second coat, and it started raining. And you know, like, it had, had all those little raindrops on the end, and it's like, it just, it, it just got stuck. You are vexed. Yeah. Oh, I was so mad, bro. So mad. Yeah, I'm not going <laughs> to lie. Who are you going to switch at? That's the thing. Who are you going to switch bro, at? Bro, I'm switching in my server in a garden, bro. Yeah, I'll mean, forgive <laughs> What do I look like back on my ring camera, boy? <laughs> yeah, to what, the one thing I'm not going to lie right now, though, is, bruv, I feel like a punk, fam. You know why? Because allergies is beating me up, bruv. Oh, see um, how we, can as a we, big man... We have, to, we have to discuss it every year, boy. <laughs> bruv, allergies is making... Bruv, it's beating me up, fam. Yeah. How can man be scared of pollen, fam? That's what it is right now. It's not you, brother. It's, it's, it's your body, brother. Brother, it's making me sneeze. My nose is blocked. Every I can't sleep at night. To be honest, this is the latest I've been up over the past three days. What, what do you mean? Allergies? Yeah, brother. I've been getting bed early, brother. Like you know, like I just feel like crap. Tired of being in my bed like all oh, eight o'clock. I can't believe Pauline does this to a certain man. You know, it's I can't so believe it. You know. So deep, bro. Shakes right now. Shakes is looking for vaccinations, fam. <laughs> <laughs> bro, my name didn't get COVID like vaccinations, yeah, but he's gonna get hay fever for vaccinations. <laughs> he's, he's, he's had enough. He's like, nah, man. Bro, he's had enough, bro. But man, man, he... man's looking for a charity for hay fever, boy. That's what I'm saying. But the thing about it is, he doesn't really take anything. I have to take the nasal spray. Like, if I don't take the nasal spray, I can't breathe and then I'm struggling. Hmm. That's long. Now, I've never... bro, you know, yeah, go on, Rich. I said I've never experienced. I don't think nah. I've experienced hay fever before. Touch wood, though, bro, because they say hay fever can come at any time. Yeah, like you, you, that's what I'm saying. Like touch wood, so far, so far, so good. Bro, you the, the don't bed and yeah. smelling that sweet smell of grass. Where just I was dumping it where, like with the springtime. You don't like grass, freshly right. cut grass, freshly cut Isn't grass it? must Isn't get it? you differently. Say, bro, man. I don't even like going up right now. My grass is higher. I'm not even gonna bother. I'm not even gonna bother cut it. I was gonna leave it this year. I don't know. I know I'm looking to move soon, so I don't care about it, bro. Come on. Yeah, but nice. Nah, Wait until that. the foxes come in it. Yes, Start making a home. Start making a home. That's what the problem is. The foxes and the cats and all <laughs> that. It's long. Yeah, I'll cut it soon. I'll, I'll cut it soon. I'll cut it soon. But yes, everyone's good. Everyone's Chris. Everyone enjoyed their bank holiday. Yeah, man. Yeah. yeah. Looking forward to your 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 next bank holiday next week, Monday. Jeez. Come, come on. Like these four day weeks, bro. I think I could get used to it. Well, this, this should just take the whole of me. Like, just have four four day week thing. Hold, you get me? It should be that permanent going forward because the, the what you do, what you do in three days, it's like my whole weekend's planned better. It's so it's so planned, but like on it, when you got this to two days, you, you're rushing to do everything, and there's no time to enjoy it and and even rest. Do you get mm. what I mean? I did everything Monday, Saturday, Sunday. Today, technically, I've been chilling. Right. You know them ones. That's, that's that's what I want to do, man. I just want to. I just, anyway, I just I don't want to work. I just, let's be honest. 
I'm with you, man. I'm with you. With you. <laughs> I just told I'm you. I'm with you. You know, I, sh- I shared the tie the other day. Yeah, Ty was like, like he he doesn't work on Fridays. Well, I said, what do you mean? What do you, what, what do you mean? Well, you don't work on Fridays because as a company, we don't we do not work on Fridays. So you four day week thing. I'm like, what? He goes, yeah, bro. But does, do, do, do they get do they get paid four days a week though? But no, they get paid like normal, normal. Okay. But does he work longer hours during the week? I don't night? think so. I think he, I think it's the same as ours, bro. Bro, I feel like I'd even, I'd even make that please. sacrifice, you know. I'd even make that sacrifice if you if you said to me an extra hour or two, like Monday to Thursday. I, I think everyone would, you know. Yeah. I think everyone would put an extra two extra added two hours to to the day. Not a problem. Yeah, exactly. You know what I mean? Do you reckon it'd be better that everyone has Friday off? Or like everyone chooses what day they have off. Like, do you know what I mean? Like, you just have to do four days. Now, to me, to be fair, I give me the Monday off. I always want you prefer Monday, Monday off. off. Yeah, I, I'm Friday, just... Friday's kind of that exciting day, and it's like, especially when you got something planned after work. It's like, yeah, we can start us now. I'm like, yeah, Monday's like. Mm. The, only good, my... the, only, the only good thing is, like, our workplace we work from home Mondays and Fridays, isn't it? So obviously you're in the comfort of your home, so it, it, it does feel like a day off in a sense. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like you have to wake up, go take a get on a train, and blah blah blah. Do you know what I mean? I think my best four day week that I used to work was when I used to have Wednesdays off. So you work Monday, you're like, okay, tomorrow I've got one more day at work. Then you have Wednesday off. Then Thursday, you're like, oh, I've got one more day at work, and then that's it. That's the only you know Wednesday is probably like the peak of the week, isn't it? But when like, you say it like that. Yeah, I see, I see the excitement. Yeah, that's what it was. It was just bare excitement in my head. I was like, I'm only working tomorrow, and then I got a day off. That's it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wednesday, but it's yeah. a psychological thing, isn't it? It's, you got to just, however, you psych yourself up to do them things. But I question how many people who actually work four day weeks actually work on one of the days off that they they, they do have, because mm. like because a lot of like, people in my organizations, right? Even though they got a day off. They quickly, I can see them sneaking online. Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah. You're on annual leave. That's how, the... many, how many people, people will stress themselves out at the same time? But I think it's a mentality thing is getting used to having that four day week and how to manage your time better. Hmm. Yeah, that's the worst thing I like because the email team, Bruv, you just randomly pack, catch yourself looking at email on a random yeah, like, on a random shit. Sunday night or a you know, like, oh shit. Oh, but if I just do this now, it means I don't got to do it tomorrow. You feel like we're always working, man. Yeah, especially especially at during COVID times where we were like, oh, it was, it was awful, wasn't it? Yeah, you're logging off all like lo- you're logging on at mad times and logging off at mad times. Mm-hmm. And the thing is, you know what I've started to do, yeah. You know, I set I send the timer on my emails, isn't it? Yeah. So it just it just fires emails. People are thinking, oh, which is online already? Nah, mate, it's my timer, mate. Yeah, you got like, you got. I, to set- yeah, emails that you want to send, like don't send them late at night. Send them first thing in the morning, like seven thirty. Yeah. Email that bullets. schedule email seven thirty. It's pure bullets. I love that. When I found out to use it, when I found out to use it properly, I was like, yeah, this is this 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 is very useful. Um, teach me, please. No problem. Hey. Yeah, I'll let you know, bro. Because I used to when I used to wear my last school, I was like, hey, when when this is head used to be just firing off emails like stupid o'clock. Like, don't email me at night time. You get me? Why are you emailing me at 11 30 at night? Allow me, it's my time. Email at yeah. seven o'clock in the morning. At least it's a little bit more reasonable. Yeah. All right. Well, guys, this week we've had lots and lots of trailers. Lots and lots and lots and lots of trailers. Some that uh, Merv sent to the group, some that others have come up. We'll quickly go through some of them. Um, let's say if we're looking forward to them. We have the Equalizer free, and I'm not talking about the show with um. I'm not talking about my stash. Because oh, 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 oh. I know the they, they must have, they might have even a season four soon, yeah. But we're talking about Equalizer free with Denzel Washington. Imagine uh-huh. the season four. How, who, who's are you funding it? <laughs> I'm stop me funding, bro. The fu- bro I'm you know, it. sponsored by the fully good pods. No, but... <laughs> imagine, imagine uh... any credits you see 
um, uh, Executive say, producer. <laughs> and, and funding. Bravi, I don't know why you like, I don't know why you like hating on it, bro. Cancel. Bravi, fully got three seasons, you know. It's actually having gay. Fully three seasons, fam. So, what are we saying? Are we here for the Equalizer 3? Oh, yeah, right. yeah, yeah. So, the last one as well. So, with that trailer, yeah. yeah, they showed too much, though, man. They did, didn't it? They showed yeah. too much. They did, yeah. That's why I, 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 I just hope, yeah. I just hope, whatever we saw, there's a lot more of that. that yeah, not... exactly. I reckon there is. I reckon we, I think we're gonna write. I think Denzel, he still got it in him. I think, yeah, I'm looking forward to that one. And apparently, they did, they, apparently they did a Man of Fire as well series. Oh, is it? Yes. On, they, on Netflix. I, yeah, yeah. That's, I thought that's what... They said they, they've been planning that for a little while, to be fair. But yeah, mm. they're going to do a Man of Fire um, TV series. Yeah. Um, we had The Witcher season three. I watched yeah. The Witcher, so I don't really know. So Henry, so Henry's still on this season then? Yeah. Um, he'll, he'll... Liam Hemsworth will be in season four. So I think, okay. I think when he announced that's... that he was not going to yeah. be in it, they already shot season three anyway. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I I, I, did, yeah. I didn't I didn't watch much of it. Um, it it wasn't like a very um detailed trailer. I don't think it looked. Yeah, it wasn't detailed, but it just for some reason I felt excited for it. Mm. And maybe because it didn't give too much away. Maybe just like, and I think I think as well because everyone like loves Henry Cavill and it? it's like his last one. It's like I, mean, I think people have to just tell themselves that yeah, I mean I'm in for it, isn't it? I wonder what will happen though. Like once this. Over there, right? Boy, I don't know. Do Superman? Be fine, isn't it? Let me just um, come back and do it. Just don't ever come back. Don't do anything. <laughs> yeah, I, I think Witcher was a program that Mike used to watch. I don't, I've never watched it before. I, I watched it, and and uh, did you did you see the spin off one? One with um, Bish- yeah, 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 the, yeah, the prequel. Yeah, yeah, and then the good. animated, the animated ones as well. Was that anime ones? Yeah, anime ones. Yeah. Come on, guys. But how, how, did, how yeah. did it go? What do you mean, how did it go? Like, was it good? Yeah, yeah it was good. good. Yeah. They were, they, were, they were on Netflix. I think I might have watched, actually, the anime one. When Don't did like, that come out? A few years back. Just go, just go with it. Yeah, about a year, about a year, a couple of years back, yeah. Yeah, no, if it was a few years back, I think I did watch it, actually. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was called The Witcher, The Nightmare of the Wolf. Yeah, that's it. Uh, Cal didn't watch it. He's looking. He's trying no. to. Yeah. Well, no. Yeah. I watched so many animations. I, I thought it was a, re- I, I thought it was a recent one. I thought it was like like recent. But if it's a few years back, I do remember. Yeah, it. no, it's, it's, it's 2021, bro. But what, what are we going to lie about this, bro? Come on, man. Yeah. Bitch. <laughs> I see that the, the clogs just turning, boy. Yeah, I'm trying to remember it. I'm trying to think. The clogs. <laughs> cogs. 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 Oh, okay. Oh, it's maybe because it's lies. We'll hear it. We'll hear it back. I was gonna say just this. <laughs> <laughs> like, the Dutch shoes. What are the Dutch <laughs> shoes doing? Um. Okay, I didn't watch this because I don't want to ruin it. Which was the Flash. So they released the trailer too. Mm. Yeah, I know. I started watching it. I started watching it. I stopped. I was like, no. Um, yeah, no, yeah, I, can't, I can't. I can't finish this trailer. And I'm I think because play. it's so close to release, or oh, well, it's yeah. coming out in the next couple months. I'm just not. I can't. Let me just watch it. Mm. I saw somebody was writing comments on the the um, Instagram page, um, saying that they think it's going to be shit. I don't know who that was. Someone used the official account, but I'm not sure who that was. Mm. <laughs> well, James, um, James Gunn said it's like one of the best comic book movies of all time. And he came, and it's not to say like, because he came in after the film was made, isn't it? So it's not to say like, it's, it's, it's production. So for him to say that, it's like... Yeah, but it's like, you know what it was? I think because he waited so long, Yeah, I don't know anymore. I, I still don't know either. Like, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm reserved about it, isn't it? I think I've seen too much already. I, I think, like you, well, not, well, unless you guys have seen it, but there's, Things that they've put in there already in the trailers, even from the very first trailer, even before the first trailer, it's like we all knew who was going to be in there. I'm just like, that's more no, than there's enough. no excitement for it anymore, isn't it? What do you say, Rich? Uh, what I was saying is, it's like, like I haven't seen the latest trailer, but the yeah. one before showed us too much anyway. Yeah, so yeah, it, yeah. Also, even the, even like the very first teaser, like, I just thought, like, look, 
you're you're always gonna get people to watch comic movies, and you don't need to do so much. Do you know what I mean? Well, like, I, where where this is gonna be the is it the reboot? I think that's potentially rebirth. Why rebirth then? Yeah. Sorry. Is he frozen? <laughs> oh. Yeah, no, like, yeah, so because it's, fro it's frozen. <laughs> yeah, cause, so because the rebirth, all we could do is hope that going forward, DC will make more sense now. So apparently yeah. this is going to be like the, the start of the DC verse now, isn't it? So Because basically we're going back to Flashpoint, yeah? So basically this is their version of the multiverse. Yeah. yeah, but they've always had the boy verse to be honest. Yeah, yeah. no, but what I mean, no, I know they've always had yeah. it, but what I mean, it's like you know, like how now in with Marvel, you can do whatever you want, go back forth, make up stuff, and all the rest of it. So, this is their version of that. Like, Flashpoint is their yeah. version of let, let's reset, yeah. And I believe it comes out on the 16th of June, yeah, it's that soon, you know. So, that's yeah, that's that's just a little yeah, over man. a month away. Come on, I can't wait, man. Or are, we, are we all linking up or is it an individual team? I don't know, man. But, love, let's be honest, yeah. If it comes out the 16th, I want to watch it that weekend, boys. Come on, man. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm not on this. It's a straight like, rating, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I'm not on this shaggedy. Oh, I forgot. No, that's, forgot. that's no, no, no. That's what I'm saying. Let's say it now. If it's if it's the us man thing, let's do it straight. I but agree. You, yeah, let's yeah, us man thing. Let's go and watch this, man, because it's gonna be a, a monumental mm -hmm. movie. You get me? So, so oh, oh, okay. Look, we've got that's the weekend of the 16th. Oh, that's Father's Day weekend. You know, Merv's already got Merv's already got plans already to watch this from by himself, boy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I know. Merv, What's that you for, man? No, no, I, I know. Merv I know. Said Merv's going with Wes and, and Merv, Junior. He's already got your plans, bro. Yes, yes. Straight. <laughs> no denial. No <laughs> denial. <laughs> I can never. I can never confirm or deny. <laughs> He's already booked his tickets. Um. That is Father's Day weekend. So you, you think the missus want to take us there for Father's Day? I doubt it. I doubt it. We'll come out on a Friday or something, no? Yeah, Friday. Yeah. I work on Fridays, but unless you're going to go to a late one. Yeah, we could do a late one, man. Pause. Rich, you're going to be down. I don't know yet. Uh, when is it out? In June. Yeah, 16th. Yeah, yeah. You've probably heard that. Yeah, I've got weird made, bruv. You heard 30 seconds ago, bro. Man's in May. He asked me about now in June. Yeah, why not? May, June's but, but, the corner. But it's because you enough time. Because we're exactly. Oh, yeah, by the way, guys, you know, um, yeah, like, I'm coming. That's what you were saying. No, no, no. The man just said, yeah, let's do it together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, now, now he's putting doubts. No, <laughs> just... but I'm saying, he's, uh, the, the date's in June. He asked me, like, now. I'm telling you, let's do it together. But you're telling me, I'm gonna, am I going to be free? It's like, well, I did say, let's do it together. Is that, well... What you you're making no sense. No, I said, I said, let's let's do it together. And you asked me, am oh, I gonna be yeah. free? It's like I'm gonna be free. But I'm saying let's do it together, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, that's just that's all right, I mean. all right, Rich. You, yeah. you just you, you just love confusion. All right. Let's eat cool. popcorn. Right, now, exactly, how right. small is that popcorn you're eating? Bro? So you're just eating the seeds. <laughs> you know, you, you know, it's the bottom. Like, bottom I don't see no pump. pump. <laughs> I don't see no pump. This, isn't it? Like, bro, you know, it's the bottom. The best seeds, the pure <laughs> seeds in the bottom. Yeah, it's it's only like it's like, like, like you know, oh, pumpkin seeds or something. The business will get stuck in his teeth. Then one, yeah, yeah, them ones. Size and popcorn, you know, I've never seen in my life. You know. <laughs> it should be like, like that. Like, it's like it should be like the the shit. Yeah. You know, they get me. <laughs> you know, they bump me in it. They gave me all the when you, you just pick them up, you pick it up, and you just think, hold on, you open it, and it's, there's no big bits in it. It's just small bits. They bump That's me. The worst. The worst. Yeah, you just got crumbs and what? Well. <laughs> All right. Um, Transformers: Rise of the Beast. Obviously, that's yeah, coming out soon. Dude, the fifth of May, isn't it? Is it the fifth of May? Yeah. This weekend. That yeah, can't be. That's um, Guardians are coming out this. Guardians week. is coming oh, out this. Oh, week. Guardians. Oh, is, that, is that coming out this weekend? Guardians. Yeah, Guardians is coming yeah. out this weekend. Yeah. Bank holiday yeah. weekend. Yeah, oh, yeah. That's the one I'm watching. Yeah, you turned to confuse <laughs> me. I don't know when Transformers not, are coming out. Not this. Yeah, it's this weekend. Yeah, it's this weekend. Yeah, this yeah, weekend. yeah, it's coming out this weekend. It comes out. On, I swear, it comes out like on a Thursday. Yeah. Transformers: I mean, Rise well, of the Beast comes out June the ninth. Okay. Yeah. So that will be the week before a flash. See, look, 
I thought, oh, this one. When I first saw the like, first trailer, I was like, yeah. Because it, cause it looks more original to the original designs and that. When I saw this trailer, I thought, mm, this looks a bit Michael Bayish now, man. Back to the original one. So you feel, like, every... feel that? Not really. I just can't say when there's something that everyone's everyone's funny in it, isn't it? Like, everyone's making jokes. Yeah. But this this how, this how I feel about Marvel now. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Right. I, I don't know. I just find Transformers, it, it's good for when you watch it when the cinema has a similar experience. After that, it's absolute nonsense. Not not the the, the, mm. the one before the night, the one of Anthony Hopkins. That was a joke, man. All of them. But I swear that film was like four hours. No, no, not all of them. I, I think the first one was good. Oh, one was phenomenal. Yeah, yeah the first one was good. No, no bro, it, it's metal versus metal and crashing into buildings. It's that it, I know you man like it's like action films. No, that's all me, pro Transformers or Diesel. That's that's Transformers, isn't it? No, yeah. that's what I'm saying. That's you're, what I mean. You're, you're getting nothing different. No, what I mean is when you're watching it, but ask me an hour and a half later what happened. I don't yeah. know, bro. I, 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 I just know there was lots of explosions. That was in the last one, bro. Crashes like... and. The, ed- the editing, I was like, why is Optimus Prime on the floor? Next, next scene, he's in the sky, caught in, in wires. I'm like, I don't know what's going on here. And Anthony Hopkins is seeing some madness, bro. I'm like, get me out of this cinema. To be fair, I may not have watched the last one, you know. It's one with like the dino bots in it. He's with his like black and white, yeah. basically. I think the one that last one I watched was the one with um... Bumblebee. Well, no, that's not really. Hard. No, um, what's that guy? Um... Mark Wahlberg. Yeah, Mark Wahlberg, yeah. Yeah, yeah I like Mark Wahlberg. Also. Whatever that one was, yeah. I, yeah, I, did like I think, I've, yeah, Age of Extinction might have been the last one I've watched, to be fair. I don't think I watched last night. Maybe I have to watch that one. Yeah, we kind of be like a bit too um, Fast and Furious y kind of for me. And get yeah, Fast and Furious. I don't understand. You've got such a perfect franchise to work with. I just like, those films should be the best of the best. Obviously, we still got the new Fast and Furious coming out as well at some point. Yeah, the family. Is, is that the last one as well? No, and they're doing... So the 11th one is going to be Fast X Part 2. Man said the 11th one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's the same director's doing in everything. I, I just know that my man's back in it. The East Asian guy who was supposed to be dead. And he was all. back in the previous one. Yeah, but I haven't watched. That's, I haven't watched uh, any of them. Uh, like, I stopped watching it. Yeah. From they can fall out of skies and airplanes and in space and they can land with all wheels and not one wheel pops. I just not in it. No. Uh, <laughs> but they need to go. The next one they need to do is go multiverse, isn't it? That's what they need to do. I think they've ticked off every box. Oh, but I mean? like I said, I will watch this just because it's got Aquaman in it. Oh yeah, yeah. So oh. I will watch it. Um, they had a new Hunger Games. I, I, yeah. Was that what is that? Is that a musical? I didn't understand that. No, it's a prequel. Prequel. So, like when Snow, what was his name? General Snow or Emperor President Snow, like the Donald Sutherland character. I don't know if you've watched the. Do you want to be honest with you? I don't think I've watched any Hunger Games. Dizzle. What? Diesel, I've not seen one Hunger Games film. I don't think I've one Hunger Games. I've not seen one. I've not seen one Hunger Games film. I've I've watched like Diver Divergent. Yeah, yeah I've Divergent. seen that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've I watched those. that one. Yeah, yeah, I, 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 I like those. Those are good. Yeah, I like, yeah. Yeah. I've probably watched that like last year. You know? I like mm. they're good. Hunger Games, I don't even know what. It's about. I, yeah, I don't know what Hunger Games. I don't know what it's about. I don't, I know I know the main actress in it, but I don't know like the story. I think I kind of know what the storyline's about, but. I... I ain't watched so any of the films, so yeah, I can't comment. Yeah, so like you haven't watched it too, Richard. You're silent. I'm never watching. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we've also got um, finally, Bel Air season two is coming out on British television. I know yeah. some of you have already watched it. Um, all episodes will be released this Friday on Sky Max, so we'll have all the episodes. It was a good season, you know. No, no, no spoilers, but it was it was a decent. It, was, it started off a bit like oh, was this again, but it got it got deep, and then yeah. yeah I heard it. I heard it. I heard it. So obviously, I, I got bank holiday weekend, so I will be probably pause. I'll try to bang out episodes and keep it moving. Um, snowfall, please. Yes, give me two weeks, guys. Come on, man. <laughs> two weeks. <laughs> hey, but it, for snowfall, you don't need two, two weeks. No, I Honestly. do because the, the reason why I need two weeks is just because I need to obviously still catch maintain up. catch up with other shows, isn't it? I feel like when I watch Snowfall, I'm just going to be in Snowfall. How many episodes? Ten episodes? Yeah, ten. Yeah. 
A solid hour as well, yeah? Yeah, a solid hour. Yeah. 45, 50 minutes. That's quite different from me. Possibly if I start today, maybe. The thing is, yeah, my my niece that watched, I was like, oh, you're, no, 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 you're too young for this. You're too young for this. She goes, no, it's 16 plus. I'll be 16 next year. And then, <laughs> but yeah. she started watching. I was like, rah, look at them. Young. They're so young. And I, th- I didn't realise um the Mexican guy was in the first episode. I, th- I didn't realise that, you know. I thought he could be later on. Who's the wrestler? Uh, what's the, his name? Yeah. yeah. Did they first met in the first season? I know. I, no, when first episode. Big. The first yeah. episode. Yeah, I thought he came later on in season one. I didn't know he was in the first episode. I, I, could, I, forgot, yeah. I totally forgot about that. And when they first met, they said, "Oh yeah, um, if you need anything, my name is Franklin Franklin Saint." No, he, got, no, he, no, he went up to me because I, I want your autograph. Oh yeah, because no, he was wrestling, yeah, innit? Yeah, he was wrestling because oh, oh yeah, I and, then, your and, oh, and yeah. then there was, there was... Oh, guys, guys, what you tried to do there? You tried to sneak Snowfall in. We're not doing this. <laughs> We're not doing this. <laughs> that was good. Well done, boys. <laughs> Well done. <laughs> man, we're going to then just go off on a little tangent. We're not doing it. Before you know, <laughs> before you know, Richard, it's season six, you know. <laughs> we're not doing that today, guys, but well done, all right? Shout out you, Rich, because you didn't want to watch it and then you got onto it. So well done. And now you finished it. All right. Also, Top Boy, season three, showed oh, us a... I don't know what that is, a promo? I don't know, I guess a promo. Yeah, it's like it only like what, 31 or 45 seconds. Yeah, yeah. The, 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 the Netflix thing was the longest part of the trailer. <laughs> um, Obviously, it's really Top Boy Season 5, isn't it? But um, it's a fight. this is the final season now. Yeah. 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 I'm looking forward to it, to be fair. Yeah. I, obviously, within the 30 seconds, there wasn't much to show. But... It's it's um Sully is it Sully yeah yeah S- S- Sully and um what's, Shane. What's, what's, Shane. Sully and Shane they always they always like it's always love hate they're always beefing and reconciling and beefing. I mean, one it? of them will die. I do. Uh, I do. Which which one? Sully. Um, nah, I f- I think Shane. You know, I don't think Shane. Shane. I think it will just be living like some beefing. And Sully will die. In it. Possibly both of them. Uh, what was the quote that Sally said? Either your food or your you're a monster, either you're a monster or you're the food. That's something like that, yeah. And I ain't gonna be Yeah, exactly. Mm. I want what's the name to come back? Dave's character. Who? Oh yeah. Oh Dave's... but you he, he went pen, right? Or did he die? I think he went pen. Yeah. I don't think he died. I want him back. But do you know what? Wasn't Scorcher in it? The first season. Yeah, Scor- Scorcher died. In the the first remember, season, they, they, they killed, killed him. Died, yeah, they killed in him. In season they two, him. Yeah. they buried him. They buried him alive. He was all right, though. He was all right still. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, Scorcher plays a good baddie. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. that was good. Yeah. Definitely does. Yeah, so I'm looking forward to Top Boy. Um, and the other one I was going to say was, obviously, just because we were talking about last week, Fatal Attraction have now come with a TV series. It's now on Sky Paramount? Paramount, Paramount Plus? Yeah, Paramount. Why um, I've watched the first episode. It's all right. It's like obsession. Right. Nice no, bit of obsession. It's been obsession. It's been obsession. Mm-hmm. Obsession. It's not obsession. Is not nonsense, you know. It's all right, you know. No, it's, it's not. <laughs> but the only the nonsense thing about it is that how I know you guys spoke about it last week is like how the dad fell in love so quick. Like, I didn't get it. Do you know what I mean? It it, it make, the the proof. I don't like obsession. That, that, it makes no sense. That I can understand, like it's just, just that that instant uh, attraction, isn't it? No, but the guy's feeding her, feeding her olives within two seconds. Pum pum is great, isn't it? No, but he uh, never he ain't tasted pum pum at that moment there. No, oh. like she, he met her for they two just seconds, each other. and he's feeding her olives, and man's just, I'm like, wow. Like she may have that aura about her, but I was like, you're moving wild. Like you have a wife at yard. Because he, he might just make he just made excitement. You know, everyone's like. He's probably just bored in his marriage. I, 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 no, I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't Murph. You know, Murph's... Oh, I see... I see, <laughs> I see, well, I see you, Murph. Like I, 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 I see you, Murph. I see you. I'm going to my hand. Tangibly. Nah, nah, nah. I, 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 know, I see what you see, Kel. But for me, it was it was too unrealistic. Yeah. But don't get me wrong. The sixties were steamy, though. The sixties were steamy, but I was like, oh. So last week, I spoke about that. I need to watch it on Gogglebox, yeah? 
Boggle Box had me rolling. <laughs> bruv, them people, bruv, they watch the scenes. Oh, that was a bit intense. And then we got so our next next family. It was over a bit quick, really. Kind of got over it before it even started. It was like, dude, bruv, they were ripping it. Bruv, it was so funny, bro. <laughs> Boggle Box, I have to big them up, bro. They're funny. You know, I, not that I will, or anything, no, anything that ever happened to me, I'm, I'm kind of glad I had my. my my son, I uh, old age because I know there's no chance of that happening. You get me? Because like I, I'll be a big man, big, 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 big man. Them times there. Yes, <laughs> that's, that's, that's something for me. It was a lot, bro. You never know, you know. <laughs> nah, <laughs> man, it was. I still oh, imagine, imagine something so hotty like, and then she's on it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, old darling. <laughs> nah, that, that's a, I'm trying to make sure your teeth stay in. Nah, but that's. I feel that's a different. St- so now he went looking for her. And then, yeah, like I said, yeah. when he went to France, I said, no, 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 no. Yeah, but sure. remember, she, she, she knew what she do because she got his, she, she, she stole his his number from the son's phone, in it, mm-hmm. to text oh, yeah. him. Oh, but yeah, that, that, yeah, that guy into Belgium, and even when the son died, like, yeah, he's dead now. Let's just continue with it. Let's that part, it. you know what? That that part shocked the hell out of me. You know, <laughs> I was not expecting that at all. But man, oh, man. Is, the girl's all like she's probably in trauma and everything, just like just thrown thrown out and everything, and he's like. Well, it's done now, isn't it? Like, let's just let's continue with it. Like, nah, but so what, what about the end? Did it go off together or, or no? What happened? Nah, nah. nah. She, she she went she went off, innit? Yeah, she did. She sold her. She I don't mean, know. She sold the. She left in the flat, innit? Or something. Yeah, she didn't want. She wanted to be a part of it, man. It was for me. I just think it was stupid. But it's not like that. Well, you so watch, you watch it, Rich. You didn't watch it. No. Oh. Watch it, Rich. Watch it, man. It's, it's a good. It's it's quick. It's like thirty six minutes each episode. Yeah, this <laughs> one's forty four. I think, but it's like it's four four bad. parts. Is it worth it though? Really? Yeah. No. You know what? It, it's, it's an enjoyable watch. It's a. It's a. It's a I think it's an enjoyable watch. Okay. It, it's food for thought. Yeah. Just talking about what we, for example, stuff you watched last week. Obviously, because you spoke about watching Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, and then Rich then messaged in the group. I then also went and watched it yesterday. I should have saved, my... saved, saved my time, yeah. Like, but like that aside, it was nice seeing some of the old characters, like Billy. But I so feel like I've seen I feel like I've seen yeah. Billy in something else though. In a retirement home. I don't know. Like, I don't know if I feel like I'll, otherwise I've or he's been another yeah. Power Rangers thing where he's been a bit of a I don't know, like. But it was. I think, he, I, think he, I think he's made some guest appearance in other Power Rangers things. Maybe that's what it is. I think I think all of them have apart from. I remember seeing Zach in anything. Obviously, Trini died very like early. Mm. Um, but I know Jason, Tommy, and um, yeah, Jason, Tommy, and Billy might have. Yeah, yeah. To be fair, I spent more time explaining it to others. Because they were like, why are you watching this? I said, no, no, no. It's the Power Rangers. It's the old one. And then they kind of saw the end montage with the RIPs and that. And they were like, yeah. oh, okay, that's why you was watching it. So I was like, yeah, yeah, well, yeah. But remember I was saying in the, in the chat, like, they should have just done it like a reunion documentary. thing. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, like a documentary thing. Because yeah, it, was, it, was just a, it was also just a very weird episode. Because, like, obviously, like, Kimberly and, and um, Jason and Tommy were just had their helmets on all the time. Mm-hmm. So obviously they barely weren't there, innit? So, it, it, and Trini as well, obviously. But it's weird, man. It it's just like, did... yeah? I, I, I watched it and I was like, what am I watching? Like, they, did, they didn't have enough for the main, the main ones to actually make it. And obviously, like I said, like with, with um, me and Trini passing away, they couldn't do it properly anyway. That's why they just allowed it. Yeah, you're right. They, they, they should they should have they should have allowed it and probably a get together in a sense of in and like, like like a friends like a friends yeah. reunion. Yeah. yeah, like how they did like, it. Get James Corden on there, like talking about Power Rangers and bring back like different Power Ranger characters and they talk on the on the sofa. Like even Zordon, like yeah, Zordon's dead. But I'm like, can you just get anyone to do a face swing and just distort it. Like, do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. like, like it's weird. No bulk on skull. Yeah. But yeah. it did make me remember that I used to rate Power Rangers when I was younger. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. No, but, no, but watching that episode, it didn't really rate anything. It's just, it's just old people trying to do moves. I, I just don't, I didn't understand it. 
Yeah. When Zach started, when Zach started like doing um, hip hop, hip hop, you know, whatever, I was like, oh god, so cringe. And, 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 and this is the thing; they've actually watched it back, and they must, they must feel like. In, quite embarrassed. See, oh themselves. man, they were like, oh, all right, sequel, isn't it? Sequel. Nah, that check, oh, that check must have looked healthy, nah. bro. It's like, oh yeah, at least we got paid for it, guys. But... That was a Netflix check. They, 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 they weren't used to Netflix checks back in the day. Yeah, it's, it's poor, but yeah, but RIP to missing um, Power Rangers, man. Yeah, because Tommy, Tommy died just before that, right? Yeah, or yeah. during? Yeah, no, he probably died just before. They would have probably, he would have probably, because he's featured in. He's the only one that's actually come back the most, you know, for for a lot of them. Yeah, and he's played most. He's played every color as well, maybe apart from pink and yellow. But um, yeah, yeah. I remember when he first came in as a Green Ranger. He this this guy was a villain. He was a, <laughs> he, he moved to everybody, battered every single everybody. I was like, who's this guy? Obviously, when he first came in, you could when someone's always wearing a color. <laughs> it's always, it's always yeah. wearing green, and it's like, <laughs> uh, he's, he's just, it's just, a guy coming with red. But why is he wearing green? <laughs> then I think an episode later, then you find out he's the Green Ranger, and uh, well, he, he was, was good for us, and then Rita made him evil, wasn't it? Oh, was he bad? I thought it was bad. No, he was good for us. No, Rita, Rita made him evil. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, okay. Because it's like, like he just started being kind of like a bastard, basically, innit? Like then, yeah, the, it, it, it and the thing is, and, the... and then when he was, then he lost his power, and then. When he came back as White Ranger, man, I wanted to cry my eyes out, bro. That he, he came back as White Ranger. At that point, did he have the flute? Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Saber, yeah. in it, saber. Yeah. No, no, yeah. The flute yeah. was the um, the Dragon yeah. Sword one. It was yes. Green Ranger. Yeah. Okay. But, but saber was the one that had the lion tiger head on the on the bottom of this. But and he yeah. should yeah. talk. Hey, can I ask a quick question? Yeah. You know when they get the dinosaurs and all the. And all the, all, and that. All, yeah. Why? Why did they go to a different planet and fight? <laughs> <laughs> I, I never understood. I never understood it because I was watching it the other day, and I was like, "What planet are they on?" Not all the time. Sometimes they fight in the city. Do they? Yeah. yeah. Is it? Boy, well, it's usually grand. some. It's usually some dusty. It, it's usually some dusty part of ground, isn't it? It's like some <laughs> dusty. Looks like it's in Egypt. They're just running through. Like they. Well, that's funny, yeah. Whenever, because obviously there was a guy inside Megazord fighting, in it, and there were scenes when his hands were just like proper blocky, like, and then there were scenes where his hands were just small, like just wearing like like latex glove, like when he's yeah. covering the sword. I thought this, I've this, never noticed that. Even. The CGI from what I watched the other day, yeah, that was that was worse than the was original. Terrible. Yeah, it was terrible. Just, again. If they're going to do that, just stuff like right. they're clearly doing the same formula as the old ones. Just do it. Just doing it the same way in it because. That makes us all look awful. Yeah, it was terrible. It it was terrible. I was like, these guys, did this, this, this is why I criticize actors, right? So much when they get older. And when they try and it, look, and this is a prime example of particular actors with class and who's got no class. Denzel Washington. What he does at his age is acceptable. People like um um um, Sylvester Stallone and all these all these old actors are trying to trying to force activity beyond their age. No, just don't do it. Just go away. Let give your kids an opportunity. Simple as that. But Denzel Washington doing his thing in within his age within his age bracket, not moving too much, not doing backflips or any nonsense. <laughs> just keeping it. <laughs> what older person have you seen do backflips? No, but no. I know what he, I know what he means yeah. like jumping off a building, holding two machine guns. Yeah, Tom Cruise, yeah, yeah, all them man there. Well, Tom Cruise, oh, no, you know, Tom, Tom, Tom no, no, Cruise Tom Cruise can get because he's, 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 he's yeah, a blind. He gets a blind. He gets a blind. I was about to say, I was about to say, I was about to say, I was about to because he's still got the movement, he's still got the activity. Yeah. You know that. But so Stallone and Schwartz, all them man there. I don't know if any of you guys have seen the Irishman, isn't it? But um, no. But you know, like they they de-aged Robert De Niro, isn't it? Like supposed to be about thirty. And he was beating someone up, but it was it was actually Robert De Niro's like current age fighting the guy, but at the thirty year old, and he was kicking the guy on the floor, and his his leg was like moving so slow, like probably how an older man would fight. Like now they just done this, they should have just got a different actor or hundred percent or put um done deep fake or something. 
I mean, that's the way to do it, deep fake. I'll, I'll gladly accept that. And sit right next to the fridge. But, but the thing is, even some some parts of deep fake, when they do use it, it looks really poor. No, no, not 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 nowadays, bro. In fact, deep fake is actually better than a lot of de aging that they use in film. Uh, I think I think like even at the end of um, Mandalorian season two, they de aged. Um, well, it wasn't really Luke's and um, Mark Hamill, but the technology they used in Mandalorian, I think other people were just trying it out and experimenting deep. They decided uh, to use deep fake in Boba Fett. That's why it looked a lot better. Okay, okay, okay. But yeah, pick up all the old actors. Stop acting, man. Give 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 your give your children opportunity. Push them through. Your children, you know. It's a good idea. All right. Also, um, I just wanted to take a little time out to do a big RIP to Gerald Norman Springer, who was born in Highgate, North London. Oh, yeah, I, I remember. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I remember that actually. I, I I first that. when I found yeah. out when I was young, I was fascinated. I was like, oh my gosh, he's from he's from he's from England. Like he's from the bits, bro. 30, yeah. February nineteen forty four. He died in Chicago, twenty seven well, April, twenty twenty three. Um, I think he is. I'll tell you in a moment. Um, but he was. I never uh, knew that. I never did that. Yeah, they. He was born in London during World War Two to refugees escaping the Holocaust. I said Jewish. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I knew he was Jewish, but I needed to make sure that I said it right. But yeah, man, like Jerry Springer. The infamous legend. legend, Jay Springer, man. bro. I ain't gonna lie. Was it Channel Five that you showed on? They or did Channel eventually show on. Channel I mean, they showed on Channel Five, but they, he was originally it was on UK living. UK living. Yeah, living. UK living. Yeah, UK living. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Jay Springer was a legend, bro. Like you know, like obviously he's of age and he's seventy nine years old. Blah blah. Um, but it hit me because he was like the first person I knew that showed that kind of not trash or like. You know, like just yeah, yeah, I like you really. Like yeah. trash, really. But I mean, mm. like he was of that era where we used to watch talk shows, like yeah. Jerry Springer, Ricky Lake, um, Moi Povich. Ricky. Like remember, Moi Povich used to yeah, be yeah. one. He, like, came, he came afterwards, though. Yeah, he came yeah, after. I mean, a bit after. Dude, that's what I mean. I'm was, not the father. Like, was that, you know that it was that generation where we used to actually sit there and watch those like these yeah. kind of programs. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like now, you wouldn't sit there and watch this. Come on, <laughs> I would. Would you? Well, no, what was the British guy? One? What, what, what's his name? Je- Jeremy Carr. Yeah, Jeremy I Carr. Know, I didn't, I didn't I was, he was waste. He was waste. I, I, I always thought Jeremy Carr religiously, bro. Yeah, and like, I, I used to watch it, but I was like, these guys are the scum of the earth. Yeah. <laughs> but they all are. They, all, all the guests that came on those shows are. Man. No, but his guests were. They were like, you know, <laughs> you know what? Because because, because they're from they're, they're familiar they're... to you, isn't it? I mean, it's, it's huh? Americans. They seem. I'm, like... I'm talking about cancel estate. You tell me they're familiar to me. You're probably disrespectful. Don't be disrespectful, bro. Let's not be disrespectful. I mean, no, what I mean. What I mean. <laughs> Bruv, I mean, come on. No, we, what we, I mean, what I mean is that, you, know if we watch, like that. you know if we watch a British, like, something British, like, we're, we're familiar with the surroundings and how things work, innit? Whereas when you're watching something, like, out of our country, it's a bit more phonetical, isn't it? Yeah, like, I hear you. I hear you. Like, you'll understand, like, the how things work in the UK, whereas, like, America... In America, like, you ain't got a clue, yeah. 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 But yeah, him, Jerry Springer, Steve. Yeah, remember he thought yeah, still. Steve, Steve goes on show. Yeah, Steve yeah, goes on show yeah. after a while, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, I remember I was watching some clips of that, and it just started. Literally started the first guest come out, and they're just throwing chairs about. I'm like, at least wait till like you know the, the introduction, isn't it? <laughs> I think Jay Springer also he 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 made not like the fascination. That's the wrong word, but he used to always bring in little people. Like there always used to be like little people just on an argument thing, on a beef thing, just wrestling yeah, and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He did. Lifting up their tops. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Remember they used to get the audience involved, didn't they? Yeah, and they just used to like. It was straight, it was straight fight. WWE. It was straight WWE. <laughs> straight, bro. Yeah, when, when I found that it was kind of fake, man. I wish. No, nah, but this is real, some bro. of it. Some of it wasn't fake, bro. No, it was fake, man. They had, they had nah. To. Did Look, they all, did they have Jay Spring in a musical as well? Yeah, they did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who was his favorite one? It's like you know what it is. I think they started off kind of a bit calm, and it just the world of this, isn't it? Honestly, I watched the episode of Jerry Springer 
with two brothers or the brothers or cousins and they were like Italian and they were hench and one had slept with one's wife, one found out. Listen, the blows they were giving each other, I'm telling you now, that's not fake. No, but, no, but you, you, always, you always, you didn't actually see the blows on, like you, it was showing Jerry the audience and we had the microphone like, no, nah, honestly, Giza. you see them afterwards like, Oh, where nah, did you get that blood I, from? You know? I see I see Steve running in the middle and Steve was struggling and people had to help Steve. <laughs> people have to help Steve, you know it's real. And everyone behind you going, Jerry, Jerry, <laughs> Jerry. And then no matter what happened, yeah, it's always at the end where Jerry had his little what yeah, was his, final thoughts. His final <laughs> thoughts. Oh yeah, final okay, thoughts. Sometimes, even though someone <laughs> sleeps with your wife, you still gotta just forgive and forget. Yeah, and that's take me, care of Jerry yourself. Sprigg- okay, and each take other. Him, yeah, take care of and each other, bro. Jerry was sick, bro. He was uh, sick. And if it, you know, when you talk about Jerry Springer, it brings me back to college time because <laughs> it's, it, these are the times where there was Sunset Beach at like 10 bro, o'clock. Yeah. Rich, you just in my mind. You just in my mind. I'm going to say Sunset Beach, then Jerry. That was like, it, bro. After, <laughs> bro, you read my mind, Rich. We were in student life. Everybody, yeah. trust me. <laughs> no one cared. Trust me. Oh, well, Those are uh, good times you now. Those are good old days, bro. Right yeah, it's a proper work to watch TV, though. Yeah. It was a yeah, privilege, bro. Jerry, to watch TV. Jerry had the right. too hot for TV. Do you remember as well? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Was that? Yeah, too, the hot too hot for TV. TV. They used to come out like DVDs and that. Like They were like yeah. Jerry Springer. Like, no way. But you are for that. No. Yeah. They were also, that used to be on the WWE Network as well. So he was, bro, he was sick, bro. Oh, yeah. Uh, he, he took it, yeah. He, like I said, he made violence acceptable to a certain degree. I <laughs> <laughs> pick up Jerry, man. Shame. And there was the Jerry Springer UK show here as well. We had a, a UK version. Oh, yeah, he did do that. He did. He did. ITV. Yeah. But yeah, no, RIP J Springer, man. Um, yeah, I may go and watch some more Jerry Springer. After this. <laughs> Anyone remember Trisha? Yeah, yeah. Michael, Michael. Trisha Goddard. Trisha, yeah, yeah. Trisha Goddard. Yeah, yeah, Trisha. Yeah, yeah, Trisha, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah. You know, she, was, I... she was a bit too, she was on the other side of Jerry, and she was like more of the sensible side there. Yeah, like, yeah. yeah. Who was that one on BBC? And I saw he had white hair. It's going to bug me, man. Him or her? Oh, Kilroy. Yeah. Kilroy. Yeah, Kilroy. Kilroy. Yeah, Kilroy. Yeah, Kilroy. Oh, he's old school. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I, I know, that I know. curved kind of stage is just this. Yeah, 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 I was, yeah, I was, yeah. I was on Kilroy wife. before, you know. Serious? Yeah, I was on Kilroy. Well, audience or on a, um, a panel? Uh, both. All right, basically, Seriously? what happened was, yeah. Well, you, so, you ran out to fight someone, yeah? No. <laughs> <laughs> That's not how Kilroy was, bro. Kilroy was a bit more serious, yeah? Yeah. But basically, what happened was, there was like an episode where, I don't know, they were talking about like youth culture. And you know, like how you got like Middle England, and they're just cussing, basically. They're just cussing the youth of today, yeah? So something told me that I must write an email to them to say that's not how it goes. Mm. So I wrote one lengthy email, like, and I sent it to them. And then the producer of Kilroy got in contact with me and they invited me to come to an episode. Wait, what year was this wrong? Um, maybe around 2000, like 2000, 2001. I think I just, okay. I'd left school. Okay. So basically they called me and then me and Yaya went. So they sent yeah. a car to my mum's house to come and collect R&B. us. Yeah. Right, PR. They drove us down there to studios, or whatever. And then, like, he comes, he goes, Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to go to this person, go to that person, do the yeah. And then basically, I kind of got like stage fright, yeah. So the person in front of me before <laughs> me was talking too much. So they were supposed to come to me, and I couldn't get the words out. And like, he didn't like say, And here's Nathan, you know, like, he said, This man, then that man, then you. And he didn't kind of go to me. So I kind of lost. So the camera just zoomed on you, you were like, uh... Uh, yeah, and then it kind of just went, and I was like, "Oh shit, I, I fucked up." But the whole time, I just going, "I missed my spot." Yaya yeah, yeah. spoke, and like I said something a little bit later, but not like I was supposed to be like a, as a guest a bit. Like I was supposed yeah. to probably tell them about myself and how the people are wrong and how they think of us and all this shit. I didn't even get to, but I remember my nan recorded it for me. That's what I remember. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I'm never gonna find that video. I ain't gonna find that. Them, them times VHS, bro. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Like it was in my nan's house. I don't know. Is where it, is it the attic somewhere? Yeah, I don't know where them videos have gone. But yeah, yeah. Shout out Kilroy. But anyway, enough of that, bro. Let's get into some um, power. Can I, can I just say something quickly? I don't want to get into a full conversation about it, but 
I can't believe man ain't talking about um um Arsenal. Yeah, so um power. This guy, no, no. Like, Rich, you see him, Rich, you see him. You no, see this guy, be, bro. No, 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 big up Merv. Why shouldn't why should we gloss over it? We can't just speak when we're, when we're always winning. We should speak no, about no. tough times. Well, as no, well. What I'm trying to say is though, this guy, this guy. He doesn't want us to talk about football. He wants to talk about football. I don't hate football. I don't hate football. Bro, like, I just don't watch it. Yeah? I, I, this one, I just happened to watch the whole like, <laughs> I, bet, I bet you did. I bet you did. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, well I hope you man, watch. Did you watch? I see man take out his hair, turn Super Saiyan, isn't it? And just oh. ended the game. Ended it, bro. Oh, ended did you watch yesterday? Well. Did you not watch your team yesterday? When you were three 0 down against Liverpool, and then you came back with Charleston right, and he did the chicken dance. Me, bro. You don't know how to do it. Like, <laughs> oh, you didn't watch <laughs> I'm it. Just saying, Oh, no, no, I thought you watched it. I thought you watched it. No, no, but I heard about it. Or maybe you were talking oh. about the last week's one where you got 6-1. Was that the one? No, we talk, we spoke about that already. Bro. Oh, yeah, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, cool, yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, basically, yeah, Arsenal threw it away, man. We threw it away. Don't do that. Don't do no, that. Listen, no, listen. Don't do that. Don't do that. Southampton and West Ham, we are meant to be beating them 100%. Correct. But the fact that we won the league, we're in a, we're in a title to win the league, and we threw it away because... We didn't throw it away, bro. What are you talking about? We didn't throw it away. What are you talking about? No, no. To throw something away means yeah, to have you had part. something. Yes, it means you had it. <laughs> yes, we were there for two hundred forty-seven days. So yeah, keeps... no, but doesn't matter. We didn't bro, have it. We were top of the league for so long, bro. I hear you, but to say to say, to say to we threw it away, we had to beat Southampton and beat West Ham. Everyone knew Anfield was a no, game. No, 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 no. Hold on one second. There's five more games left, bro. There's five more bro, games that we have to win, bro. bro. What I'm trying to say is, you can't just... That's not how the world works, bro. That's not how the world... Come on. Don't make that so, rhetoric say so that Nate, we threw it Nate, away. Nate, 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 So you still think we've got a chance? What I'm saying to you is... No, no, no. Do we still have a chance? What I'm saying to you is, Man City, if they win the league, they won the league. That's it. We didn't throw nothing away. Well, when you're... Okay, so when you're ahead... No, nah, we, we didn't throw We didn't throw away. If we threw it away, Man City would be nowhere near us. We didn't throw it away. No, because that's because we had games in hand... Nate. Nah, bro. We didn't throw it away. Games in hand, bro. We didn't throw it away. Bro, don't do bro, that. Don't I, I, do that. Don't do bro, that. That's, that's disrespectful. Bro, Man City decapitated us, bro. We're we talking <laughs> about. We had no. We had no heart in that game. We didn't. Like we were useless in that game. We were terrible. No, but hold on. There's two things there. You're talking about the Southampton West Ham. We're talking about City. Exactly. Here. All of those games we threw away. Nah, we didn't throw it away, bro. We went. Bro. We, no, you could say. Okay, so quiet, Rich, Liverpool. You yeah, can say we threw away. Could we a two 0 up? West Ham, we were two nil up. Than a good one, innit? I, I you can say stuff it. like that because we were two nil up and we we didn't yeah. win the game. Okay. Yeah? Southampton, we were never beaten. We were never winning. We didn't we're throw home, that bro. away. We're at but home. We weren't never winning. We're at home. And Man City have lost four games this season. Man City no. have lost twice to Spurs. We're so, at Arsenal. We are Arsenal. No, we're not Man City. No, no, but what I'm saying is you can't say we threw it away. But that's why I didn't want to. I didn't want to do this. <laughs> I didn't want to do this. Yeah. Because well, and this why look at Merv. This is what I'm saying. We didn't we have to. Everyone's I mean, got agency here. Yeah, we was on power. Yeah. We was on power. <laughs> you lot got drawn out. I'm not going to get drawn out again. <laughs> bro, you, you, you got drawn. Because we've been chatting about for the past five minutes. So you got drawn out, bro. <laughs> I'm sweating. All right, cool. No, Wait, which, sweating. Which, which, what are you going to say? We, we threw it away. Thank you. All right, let's move on, man. What you don't think so? <laughs> I think so. He doesn't. Yeah. yeah. The, 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 like Kel said, the West Ham and Southampton were fundamental games. Fundamental games that we expected to win, especially having the season we've had. The, the Man City game could have been not I wouldn't say the word free hit, but it could have could have been a could have could have been a game where we could have easily lost. lost and, 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 and it was minor because we had that buffer from the West Ham and Southampton that's, game. That's it, man. That's it. It's, it's expectations, bro. That's what you're saying. Expectation. Our expectations are to beat those teams lower than us, exactly. which is Southampton. Everyone was lower than us. Everyone was lower than us. Yeah, but Southampton at the bottom of the league. Bottom, bottom of the table, mm-hmm. yeah? And and West Ham at that time were 19th on the... T- no, 17th. They were, the t- they, were, they were thereabouts. Yeah. And you know that every team... And we were 2-0 two, we up with West Ham. You know that every time a team comes to play Arsenal, they they raise their game. Look no, at even Man City. No, they don't raise their game. This, this is a mistake. We just turn shit. We turn shit. But look how many goals we've let in the season, especially at home. We turn. We we lose concentration. Like, bro, we just, we just lose concentration Guys, in games. It's, it's a game of football, bro. Like this is how. No, we works. always we always lose concentration in games, Nate. It's terrible. Of, like, of recent, there, there is, of no, 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 Rich. Even from earlier games, but because we won them, it's glossed over. It's glossed over. But trust mm-hmm. me, like 
if if those teams at, at times had clinical strikers or whatever, whatever, they, we would have lost a lot of games or drawn a lot of games. It's just that we won those games, so those errors weren't seen, and though our our our, our yeah. lack now, of, now, um, now we've now we've had a bad season as well, yeah. No, no, I'm not. No, 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 no that, that, that's. I'm being realistic, man. I've, I've watched, like you, Nate. I've watched the games, and I've seen that we have a run, like run teams over. Like we, have, we know, you know, it was we start off fast and we got our goals in quick. Then after that, it's like we just, we, we just don't roll our luck. But the well, other teams weren't, weren't that good enough to come back in the game. Well, we expect but of recent times, the teams have been have been good enough because we're coming to the business end of the season. Where the teams had to be able, like they, they're fighting for their lives, like and Liverpool fight for top four, they have to come back in the game, and that's when we we, we disperse. We're not there, like uh, we just lose it. We lose it. our midfield. This goes open. This opens the legs, pause. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> and there's anything could go through them. Like it's, if you see the amount of shots or chances against Arsenal, I'm guarantees it's super high. It's I, I super think high. I, I think what the problem is. A lot of our main key players, at the same time, are losing form, and yeah, or, or 100%. Lose, concent- or lose concentration 100%. at the same time. Yeah. Uh, Party, that's, 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 the, that's, the, that's the problem. No, 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 no. It's nothing. Hundred percent. No, no. That, that's. I think. I think it's. I think it's a bit over analysis. I think we've overanalyzed. I think maybe at the end of the season we can analyze it properly. I think at the moment we are talking with emotions, and that's why I feel like sometimes you no, emotions, wait. emotions gone. This is this is realistic now. No, it's, it's, it's still emotions. No, no, it's still emotions. No, no, it's still no, emotions. It's not emotions because we it's still lost emotions, bro. No, no, we lost against Man City. What three, three, four days ago? No, no. The way we're talking if, about if, the if players. We're speaking of the night of the game. No, no, no. no. It's still emotions because right now you're like, no, nah, we've we've thrown away the league. We've thrown away. It's still no, emotions. No, it's still it, emotions, bro. If we if, if we look at the percentage. On who's likely to win the league, Arsenal or Man City, the percentage is in Man City's hands. No, but we're yeah. not talking about that. I'm talking about, but right now, when we talk, discuss the players, we're talking with emotions. Mm-hmm. Whereas, look, we just called out players like Ben White. We called out, um, we called they've out Putty. Form. They've dropped form. They have no, but dropped also, form. No, but, no, but they, they have they though. Oh, the guy dropped form. Have they? Saka, Saka's dropped form. Yeah. Nah, Saka's this dropped is- form. Second drop game for the That's why I say we're talking about emotions right now. We're no, talking no, no, emotions. It's not emotions, bro. It's not it's emotions. No, 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 no. I'm watching it. I'm watching this guy. No, but you're still I'm watching, with, watching them. No, play, you're still bro. watching with emotions, bro. That's no. what I'm saying. At the end of the it's season, emotions, at the end of the season, I feel like yes, we can have a serious conversation because at the moment, that moment there, it doesn't mean anything to us. But right now, we're still our emotions are still tied into the game. No, 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 that's, no, no, that's, I'm, that's, I'm that's, over that. That's, that's nonsense. Me, I'm still, no, I didn't, no, I didn't say. Nonsense. You, no, hey, it's that's, not. That's, it's that's not nonsense, nonsense, though. It's not nonsense. You can't say. You can't tell us we're talking about it with, with emotions. Emotions, we're not. If, if you can see, if, if, if we've the fact analyzed, that you're, the fact that you're getting minute, louder means you are talking no, with minute, emotions. No, one minute, one minute, because because your your statement, what you're making, doesn't make sense. Because we've analyzed the last four games. With Saka, I, example, I, t- I tell you why. And when sense, you're doing mate. it, you're talking over emotions. No, you, no, like, no, it is no, because no, it no, is my no, no, the no, past no, games. No, because no, you're telling us what we're doing. That's why we're getting emotional about it. Because you're telling us how what we're doing, how we're feeling. You know, you're not. You're, you're, it doesn't you're, make sense. You're you're, you're 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 thinking that we're watching a game with no tactics in mind, or no, no, we're no, not no, that's not what I said. Look, no, you, emotion. You're, you're educated. I'm, you're, you're, I'm, you're, I'm feeling like Loki right now, boy. Yeah, you're, I've got you're, all the evidence you're, to turn against you. You're a dick, bro. You're a dick. But you <laughs> are. What I'm saying is, it is you. Lot, when I say you're talking from emotions, I'm not saying you're emotional. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying you're talking. With emotion. So even we're saying for the last four games, yeah? Next. Over those last four games, we have got emotional or we have had emotions while watching the football. We have had highs, we have had lows. What I'm saying is you need to take yourself away from it. And that's why I said at the end of the season when we take ourselves away from it and we're like, in the cold light of day, yeah, you could say, yeah, actually, you know what? There should have been things that have have been done. No, and, and I'll, I'll, I'll blame, I'll test it for some of it as well. Like, I'll no, 100%, this. but what I'm, no, what I'm saying I'll is... It. Wait, wait, I'll t- I... I don't watch games with the emotion that you think I watch games with. No, 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 no. Yeah. I don't. No, I've taken my listen. I've taken myself away from what's happening. Yes, I, I, when I watched Man City, I was really upset. So mm. if you asked me at the time, it would have been a different terminology I'd be using to describe the players. Do you know what I mean? I've taken myself away from that, and I'm watching these players play, and they're dropping in form, Nate. Like, there's no question about it. They have dropped in form. Like, I don't understand. This is not emotion. This is just. 
realness. Like, there's no denying it. You can see it. Their form has dropped. It's like, the case our, of... our Teta needs to see this. Our Teta needs to stop okay. it. Wrong. We've got right. Trossard. We've got, like, okay, oh, let's, Nelson. Okay. All right, we're going to go... Okay. In Kexia. Right. I'm going to go like, back to the... Jason's, okay. Jason's not bagging in goals. Like, no, I'm going to go to the first two players you said, okay? I'm going to go to the first two players you said, and hence why I'm saying you're emotional. Because we spoke, you said Partey and Ben White. Yeah? They've dropped in form. Yeah. One second, there is no one else to replace Ben White. And Ben White hasn't dropped in form. What? Okay, if you're going to look at it, what is the common de fact? What is the common denominator? Saliba. Which, Saliba. No, which play? Who is playing right now? He plays next to Ben White and behind a party. Saliba's not there. So who is playing there right now? No, so, so I'm saying Saliba's the missing link. Yeah. So because so he's where... not there, and who's playing there now? It's, it's holding. So okay. So what we're saying is the common thing there is holding. Yeah. So actually. Is it that both of them have dropped form or is it both of them are now having to adapt their game because holding is there? But bro, like, no, hence why what I'm saying to you at the no. moment, that's what I'm saying. Just take him. That's why I said, just take a step they've back. Played, they've played role would, holding on the team. I would probably say more. I would probably say Ben White, probably yes. With Partey, I would, he's making silly individual mistakes. Okay. And what you would also say, this is why, this is why I don't want to do this here because I feel like I just feel like I don't, other fans from other teams, they watch this and they thrive off this. But what I'm saying is, you see Partey, yeah? Partey, when Partey has Saliba there, that gap between him and Saliba, yeah, isn't that big. You see when Holden's there and Holden has to take two steps back because he hasn't got the pace, yeah? Which now applies more pressure to Partey, yeah? And that's where Partey's messing up. Okay, so so Nate, so I hear you. No, I, I hear you. So, Nate. And the thing is, I'm not saying has that his then, form dropped. Then no, I'm, because I'm, because, because, because on the team has his form dropped. Yes or yeah, no? But what I'm saying is, I'm not disputing these facts. But I'm saying to you right now, I, me personally, at the end of the season, will have that discussion with all of you. I just feel like, even now as I'm talking, I know that there's going to be some Arsenal, some anti-Arsenal fan that will listen to this bit and will be in my DMs. <clears throat> Yeah, and I don't want to give them food for thought right now. We have to be united front until the end of the season. That's all I'm saying. No, we're, we're united front, but I'm not. But we're still united. That's not, that's not... exactly. But it's, I, I, it's I just don't want to give. I don't know if it's. It, we all have our own opinions. Yeah. I just don't want to. I don't think we. I just, I just don't think it's, it's time to implode yet. No, but we're not, no one's saying we've imploded. But but what 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 we're saying is we've given an advantage to Manchester City. I don't personally see Man City losing any games, especially the way they've been performing. Yeah, that's my personal opinion. Yeah, and now 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 one minute. I, I, you want to speak, I didn't I say a word. Going. I didn't say a word. I, 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 you're trying to go. I was actually trying... stretching my leg, bro. I was actually stretching my leg. My, nah. uh, I could, what leg? But I've calmed down. Pause. Yeah. Um, what so, leg? So um, yeah, but but you know what it is we we've, we've we're simply just giving an advantage to Man City now, and where where they, where they are, they're, they're at a the moment. Obviously, we can go back on top of the table tomorrow, but with their games in hand, they could easily win, and that's why the percentage has gone to them. I can't see them losing a game, but then again, you never know what happens. It's football, but how, however, we've got a very tough three games left. I think yeah, man. Three, yeah, you got games. Brighton, Newcastle. And Chelsea. And Ch well, Chelsea, you no, know what? Southampton, I don't, I, no, that's something we, we drew against Southampton, so Chelsea, anything can happen with Chelsea, do you know what I mean? So, this is what I'm going to say. So our expectations of beating these mediocre teams has kind of gone out the window because we're like, oh, hold on. I know we've got Chelsea. I know they've been playing really, really bad. However, oh, can Arsenal beat him? We should be able to beat him. Would, I believe you would still have that thought in your mind whether we had taken points off West Ham and Southampton or not. No, no way. No of course way. you would have. Of course no you way. Have. I'm going for recent performances. Now, you still would have, you still have doubted Newcastle. You still have doubted nah. Newcastle. No, no, everyone, no, everyone, no, everyone, no, everyone knows no, Newcastle. No, why is it in Newcastle you always doubt? So yeah. hence, that's what I'm saying. That, that, yeah. So yeah. the recent but, form but doesn't Chelsea, make a difference. No, no, Ch Chelsea, no. Chelsea, no. Ch I would have said Chelsea, that's a no problem. We're back. No problem. Exactly. However, our recent performances... Has made me doubt um, our, Chelsea's our, recent our team. Chelsea's recent performances shouldn't make you doubt anything. What about Southampton? Southampton, you get me. That's what I'm trying what to say. Southampton. Southampton West, there was... West Ham got beaten four one the week before they played. No, us. There was there was three teams that we haven't beaten in the league this season. The only three teams, and they were Southampton, Man City, and Newcastle. So even before yes, even before last week, we still hadn't we hadn't we had only got a point off Southampton. West Ham. Okay. Well, 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 well. 
But anyway, anyway, we move, we move. We can, we can, we can go in roundabouts. If, if, no, we're not going to, we're not going to, because like I said, this brother, anyway. So, well done. Well done, you, Merv, okay? Well done. <laughs> All right. Yeah, May the 4th, Star Wars Day. Fuck Star Wars. All right. <laughs> All right, we had power this week. All right, we had power season, power book two, season three, episode seven. I feel like finally, um, it's going to start getting interesting now. We've got three more episodes after this. Eight, nine, ten, yeah. It's starting to get interesting. Um, I will say that the boy... Who's the, who's the gay brother again? Drew. Drew? He's got mad heart. Drew's got mad heart. I didn't think he'd take out Gordo, but he did. So, big him up. Bro, what a way to go. Imagine, just in the shower, just all nice and clean. And then... <laughs> Probably yeah. the best way to go. Do you know what I mean? Nice and clean. No sins. You know, you've washed the sins off your back. Um, Monet. Um, I know you want her to die, Rich. No, she yeah, may, yeah. Uh, uh, she may have to, but she seems to have kind of got out of this one. I think she's, I think yeah. she's given herself another season. No, uh, and, and didn't she kill the, that black guy? Um, in the last week, in the funeral. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One of Elemento's people. Yeah, yeah. you well, could she... tell she was up to something dodgy. Like, do you know what I mean? I didn't believe her, like, you know, it was just all fitting around him. I'm like, yeah, you know what? Yeah. So she tried to, she tried to make it be that he was the one that set up the whole thing and he was the one that got Gordo to kill Lorenzo. Dad, Lorenzo. But you know what? I, I, I was shocked by Drew and I wasn't shocked by Drew killing him. However, I would have thought Drew would have asked him a bit more questions in the sense of like, wait, you, you're sleeping with me and, and you're, and you're, then, but you've killed my dad. Like, why? Do you get what I mean? Yeah, but I think by asking why, Drew might get taken out. Yeah, sometimes you just go like, wait, you know what? In the shower. <laughs> Loyalty in it, just boom. Bro, that's yeah. what I, I thought. Like I said, I think he's got mad heart, bro. he got mad heart. Yeah. Definitely got mad heart. I feel for Tariq. I feel for Tariq. Tariq just wants to... He wants to get out of the game. He wants to just look after his family and he keeps getting drawn into all of these things. I don't even know what happened to Tariq. I don't even know. Yeah, I can't remember. Monet, you remember oh. they, they lent on him because they were like, okay, Tariq, how do we solve this thing? Oh, yeah. Tariq then had to come out of a solution and he's just going to get it... He's just got drawn into all of these things. Like, I don't think he wants to be a part of it. You've got... um. What's his ex girlfriend's name? Iffy. Effie. 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 She's now going to get drawn into it. You've got the daughter. She's been caught on camera. She's on the recall charge. Oh, yeah. But you know what? Diana had some hot. I probably like Diana in this episode. You know? It was bittersweet the way she dealt with my man. Um, oh, she had to. I'm Trevor, Trevor, Trevor Nelson <laughs> from TV. But the David, this um, this Salim guy, it's a slime bag. Like in general, but, yeah. When he opens his mouth, I want him to die in it. Like I, I thought, I thought when she goes, you know what? Yeah, I'm like my mum. I got, I, I can handle it in it. So I thought, no, nah, is Diana gonna kill him in it? She's gonna like talk and just <clears throat> like just put a knife in his throat or something. And then she's like, actually, I've been doing some research, and also like just. Basically, some adopted privileged guy in it. So yeah, he's, just... he's a proper sleaze, but he's sleazy though. Bro, he's, 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 he's... He, he made a poem yeah. saying he likes her. Yeah. She didn't like the poem, and then he just starts switching on her. <laughs> That's real talk though. That's real nah, talk. bro, he started switching on her. You know, you know he's like that in real life. Like, bro, he's like, oh, you know that them old school man? Can I have your number? Yeah. Nah, your yeah. butters though. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, what the <laughs> fuck, you want my number? Yeah, I don't know what he's about. Like, yeah, obviously where we know he's about now, but it's like, yeah, I thought it would be someone a bit more menacing from a menacing background. You know, just like... um, Method Man, he, oh, what is his name? Davis. Yeah, he's ruined it with his brother. <laughs> and I hear his brother. His brother's like, look, I were never going to come out. But you've made, you've, you, the whole of my sacrifice for you has been done for nothing. I was busting there with them. 
He's like, look, I, I, what do you say? I, I pray on the toilet, and it's like they just kept, they kept repeating that throughout the episode, didn't it? I was bust up. Whoever wrote this, but must have been a funny time. You know that. Like, they even done it on the toilet. They've done the Russian war. Yeah. So they gave him the head yeah. on the thing. Said, yeah, the war's over. Remember, she Monet killed my man. She gave the head to the Russian and said it was him. He was the one yeah. that said you lot did it. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. Russia's like, okay, cool. We'll, we'll go about our business now. There's now a ceasefire. Yeah. The beef is over. And um, what was in it also with um, what's um, Tariq's friend's name? The dad, um, the uncle, the, co- yeah, the company. Oh, yeah. Western. Um, Western Holdings. Yeah. They it's um, kind of- it's a Ponzi scheme. And they're just taking all the money. And that's what I'm saying. And that's got Tariq's, what's it called, isn't it? Trust fund. Trust fund. Yeah, but how did he invest his trust fund in there? I, have I, did I miss something? No, he was. How did he get the trust fund? There was something. Was it was it Tariq's trust fund or was it the uh, what do you call it? Because yeah, what, what didn't Tariq get rid of a building and gave it to that? Yes, uh, the 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 guy who used to be in the wire. Yeah, um, whatever his name is. So I think he must have. That money, he must have given it to Western Holding to, to hold to kind of to invest. invest the money, to invest the money. So technically, what what he's trying to say is, Timmy's not getting his money back. Well, it is, but the money's not where they think it is. I do think Tariq and Braden need to be back friends again, though. All right, come on, that won't last long. Uh, obviously, he's in t- Tariq. He's gonna run to Tariq and say, "Listen." My family have bumped you differently. I'm just letting you know from now, innit? Just don't kill me. <laughs> <laughs> but it, but I mean, it's, like, funny how, it's funny how, like, him, the brother, the uncle, and... Is it the uncle? Yeah, the uncle and, and the girl that he's seen with this. They just turned into, like, moustache-twinning villains in that scene, you know? Like, the way they were talking and everything, it's like, we knew he was doing this all the time. <laughs> yeah. like, I found that scene so hilarious for some reason. But I think, yeah, ho- hopefully Braden gets Tariq and the Tahada money out of there because mm. he doesn't want that smoke. I think Kane and Effie are probably going to be doing it by episode 10. 100%. He paid for a college fees, isn't it? Yeah. He yeah. did. They, 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 will, they, will, they will get together. Little Bonnie and Clyde, without a doubt. But yeah, I, and then now, obviously, they've got the Rico challenge and that, that seems to be the biggest, the biggest thing. I think Davis needs to go and represent Diana ASAP because Diana, although she though she was made for this life, I don't think she's built for this life. Mm. And obviously she was caught Rex. in 4K HD, bro. <laughs> 4K HD, bro. But I liked when Effie got there and she looked straight up and said, hold on, that's a camera. Just walked away. Yeah. Yeah, yeah she knows, isn't it? <laughs> but obviously the camera is catch them. But... What I what I was saying when I was when I was watching it to myself, I said to myself, now that Lauren's in constant communication with Tariq, technically the whole thing should be blown open, and the whole, the whole thing case, should, yeah, it should be collapsed. It should collapse technically. Yeah, the fact that they they are aware she's still alive is like, hold on, she's still. Alive. I, I can't see them. She's so annoying, man. <laughs> Who? Um, um, Lauren. Lauren. I don't mind Lauren. It's the police officer. They should have made like. it real. No, it's the police officers I don't like because they the whole thing no, is like back to us. <laughs> what <I'm saying. laughs> like the whole thing is they're on Tariq, Tariq, Tariq. Tariq ain't done nothing for them to be on him. Do you know what I mean? If that makes sense. Some of them are still vexed because of ghost. <laughs> yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like you can't kill him. Like he killed the man. I just think it's silly, man. But, but do you, yeah. do you think do you think eventually Lauren will die? I don't think Tariq and Lauren will, will ride off into the sunset. I think Lauren will just end up in witness the, the witness protection program and get lost in there. No way. That can't that can't actually, that can't happen, man. Or she doesn't turn needs... up to court. I, th- I think someone yeah, might I take I wonder, who, I wonder who will end up with. Who's gonna be his Tasha? Don't know. If he would have I, I, I wanted it to be iffy, to be fair. Oh, no, but you see, Effie, Effie <laughs> actually, like, she just wants to go to college. She wants to get a better life, yeah? Like, she just wants to pay for herself to go through college. Like, I don't understand why 
everyone's on some we had to do it because you couldn't do it talk. <laughs> like why who why all of them like we had to do it because you couldn't do it? She didn't have to die. Like she didn't do anything apart from the, the where she, she they made her wear the wire she didn't realise. Hmm. Like she didn't actually do anything. Well Lauren's an idiot, just to be honest, Giza. Mm, I want it to be my girl anyway, the other one. You know the the rapper. <laughs> I want it to be her. Oh, we didn't know she could rap. I want it to be her, bro. But yeah, we got three more episodes of Power Book Two. Anyway, um, we'll see how the rest of the series goes on the Recode Charge. Hopefully, we'll start seeing some more court scenes. Um, has there been anything else that everyone has been watching or people should be watching? I know we we spoke a lot about a few trailers that are coming out. Um, and just, a new series that's starting. I've just done um Sweet Tooth season two. You? Who? Sweet Tooth. Okay. Yeah, yeah. another one. Um, the little bit has... Yeah, I haven't done. Season yeah, I need one. to watch that. Man. Yeah. Is it good? Yeah. That's, 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 that's the first episode yeah. that I need to finish it off. Yeah. It's decent. It's decent. I, I, I thought you know the ones like I thought it was going to be another. Um, what's that thing? I was watching the Shadow and Bone. I just I had to jump off it. Like when I was watching season two, first three episodes, like now I'm done. Oh. No, I actually like. Ah, uh, cool. Now, um, what, what are we watching? Nah, nothing, man. Um, I've watched The Diplomat on Netflix. I watched all um, of it? Yeah, I watched all of it. Mm. It's all right. It's all right. There's some episodes that are a bit more slower than others. Yeah. But it leaves it on a bit of... um, Like, you want a little bit more. So, like, you're looking forward to what's going to happen potentially in season two. Mm. Cool. But I saw that, that was in the top ten, so I watched that one. Um, I've been watching Rabbit Hole. Again, up I'm up to date. Yeah, yeah, same. Man. I'm up to date. I watched today's yeah. one today while I was watching in the car. Good. It's yeah, good. That's yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah, I'm looking. I, I think it's. Just, I think, like I said, I think it's a good series. Mm. Sutherland, I think, is a sick actor, and yeah, the conspiracy theories are going here, there, and everywhere. It's it's one of them kind of programs where you think you know. Something happens and then it kind of spins your head and you what you yeah, think, like you, what? Know, <laughs> yeah. you don't know anything. Yeah, yeah. That's one if you I don't know if you ever you want to watch that. Now you finish Snowfall, obviously. That's a decent series. You know, we're watching um my Titans. Have you watched it? Yeah, yeah, I've been watching Titans. You know right, isn't it? Huh? It's all right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all right. You know I don't I don't I, 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 yeah. I like I like that um Beast Boy episode. Just what? for the you're you up to date with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, you remember the Beast Boy episode and it's like Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the they're on that little multiverse thing. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Yeah. That, that's probably only yeah. the good. Yeah. The last last episode was good. I thought it was it was The yeah, last episode was quite good as well, to be fair. Yeah, because yeah, they went that like, in Doom Patrol. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So that's where that's where he's from, isn't it, Beast Boy? Do you remember? Is that it oh yeah, yeah. Oh and, and that show yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so yeah. Do you remember they got Beast Boy from Doom Patrol's house? Yeah, that's right, yeah, yeah, that's true, yeah. Yeah. yeah, I don't, I don't know. It's weird, you know, because I don't know why they haven't done it for like the original. Well, I suppose it's subjective in it, depending on what Titans you watch. But I was expecting it to be Cyborg, Robin, Beast Boy, Starfire, and Raven. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, when you just said Doom Patrol, it made me realize I didn't finish season four. It's on a, it was, I think it's on a break. It's on a break. Okay, cool. Yeah, that makes sense. Cause I sit there going, I don't remember finishing it, but yeah, yeah, yeah. What? Okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. I, oh I, yes, they're doing yeah. six and six. They're doing six yeah. and six. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I also watched um, Happy Valley. I don't know if you man watched Happy Valley, but it's something that people have been going on about all the time. And for some reason, I thought it was like a proper old series, like like probably late nineties or early two thousands. But when I looked on it, it's like it's only three seasons, six episodes each on BBC. It's got a monster named Sarah Lancaster in it. Yes. Yeah, I, well, the, the first season's deep, you know. I, I, I need to watch the second two, but I'm like, no, nah, this is this is some good British TV. Man. Oh, it's British? Yeah. Oh, what's, what's, what's it, ITV or? Yeah, BBC. What's it called again? Yeah. Happy Valley. Happy Valley. Happy Valley, okay. Yeah. Yes, okay. I've heard about it. I've heard about it. Yeah. 
and obviously right. succession. But, but, it's, but it's all finished now, though, isn't it? You know, finished, that. yeah, yeah. But I, finished, I just, yeah. yeah, I just heard people talking about Selma. That's what money. I think she used to be in Coronation Street. Yeah, Raquel, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. I say Raquel, that's it. Yeah. Where, where Raquel Welsh or something like that? No, yeah. Um, none of you watch Thingy yet, do you? Um, Ted Lasso. No. No, I've, I've started season one. Well, I finished know? season one. I I, I I haven't watched season two yet. Ted Lasso no. was so funny, bro. This week, this week they played Arsenal. Yeah, Ted Lasso's funny, bro. I don't know, bro. Ted Lasso's hilarious. Um, I need to watch it. No, I do. Um, also, I just wanted to do shout out to the Arsenal ladies today. Um, oh man! Yeah, unfortunately, man. they lost the semi final Champions League. Um, in the, the last minute of extra time, three two. But actually, what I wanted to say more, say so lost five four in aggregate. It was more the fact that the women actually sold out the stadium. Yeah, like sixty thousand plus. Yeah, big man. And also, it was yeah, a it was a, a depleted squad. Like I think three of the women have all got ACL injuries and all that stuff, like long term injuries. Yeah, and I think someone went down today, and I think that potentially long term injury. And, and they're all they're all, they're all ACLs in it. Like. Yeah. Yeah, all the injuries ACLs is mad. Yeah. Apparently, there's something about. I was listening to, is it, is it Sandra Anderson? What's her name? Oh, that woman they split for yeah. Arsenal. Yeah, I know you're talking about. Um, mixed uh, race, right? Yeah, blonde yeah. hair. Blonde hair, yeah. You were saying something about there's something with women's football in the sense of all the women are, have, are having ACL injuries. Mm. And there's a research happening as we speak about how many football, football women football, footballers. I have an ACL injuries and it's been investigated. So I see like, Yeah, I remember in uni. I don't know if you remember as well, Nate, where they said like how because women have got wider hips and then the the, the bones come in like so usually they get knock knees in it mm. more time. Some get so great at scale than others, but you, that's the that's the shape because of, of a woman's got their hips, so the knees come in and then it comes out. So they're more vulnerable to knee injuries. Mm. Especially with f- sports like football, do you know what I mean? So that could be the the genetics of it, the the, the mechanics of it. Yeah, it's definitely something yeah. to do with the biomechanics of it. It's definitely something to do with the biomechanics of it. Yeah. Um, and probably their again, definitely. like you're saying, their running gait and all of those kind of things that is making them get those ACL injuries. But it's, yeah, Arsenal got three of them at the same time. Yeah, that's mad. I said, shame that we lost, man. We're so close, so close. Yeah. Yeah, but the thing about it is it would have been nice to get there, but Barcelona, that women's team, Barcelona, ooh, they're different. They're different. They can embarrass you differently. Yeah, 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 definitely, man. Definitely. All right, guys, guess what? We've got 11 more episodes until we get to the big 200. All right. We will be letting you know what's happening with episode 200. We'll be putting out information ASAP to get you ready for the episode 200. But yeah, until such time, rate, comment, subscribe, join the Instagram page, like, leave us a comment. Um, shout out the guy that wants to go against Molly Mal. Um, we will eventually get him to respond to your Instagram, your YouTube comments. But yeah. Come on. People, hmm. peace. Peace. Peace.